Special thanks to Warner Brothers for the free and early access to the LEGO Movie 2 video game. We're here to destroy you. Huh? hope that things would ever be good again. We scavenged what we could, while we defended what remained. We call it Apocalypseburg, and it is a heckish place to live. Show weakness, and you'll be eaten alive. This new life has toughened us all. Well, toughened most of us. Emmett wasn't about to let the near total destruction of the city ruin his morning routine. After his usual coffee, he decided to come looking for me. Be on the lookout for people in need of help. You never know, you might even get some sweet rewards. Oh, hi Emmett. Looking for Lucy, huh? I'm sure I saw her go into that round shaped building nearby. Funny thing is, when I tried to follow her, the door was all blocked up with this strong stuff. Hey, maybe we can build something to bust our way in. Wanna help me find the bricks we need? So, first things first, you'll need bricks to build stuff out of. Try looking for some by smashing nearby objects. something to bust through the door. Awesome! You got your builder page. You can use it to build cool new things. Sweet! You can build your own micromanager with your builder page. something really weird falling out of the sky. Whatever it was, we had to investigate. Hopefully, Batman would be able to help us. Oh, hey, it's you. Wanna know something cool? I got this, like, really useful thing, but... It belongs to Lucy, so I can't tell you what it is. So, you got your first new outfit, huh? Looks like a good one to me. Wait, is that you, Lucy? Uh, I've been looking for you everywhere. So... Did you figure out where that shooting star landed? You should be able to see the crash site from the lookout point up on the statue's tablet. Here, you might want to take these. They should be able to help you find something that'll 
get you up there. <laughs> oh, cool. You should be able to use these to discover new builds. Good job discovering that bouncer. Now, try building it here using your builder page. Nice! You can now build my super sweet bouncer. Time for some high flying moves. Nice work. That should help you get up onto the statue and reach the lookout point. Sure looks valuable. Make sure you collect as many of these as you can. Hmm. Looks like whatever it was crashed over near the Bricksburg wreckage. If you want to go check it out, Metalbeard should be able to get you through the door. to venture out into the wasteland, I'll open the gate for ye. But best be on your guard. It be a dangerous place. Okay, so you're now able to explore the wasteland. There's lots of stuff to see, things to do, and probably some people to help. So make sure you have a good look around. We almost reached our destination, but I couldn't shake the feeling that something bad is waiting for us. Hey! Somebody! Help! Somebody! Thanks for that. I was searching for a giant alien beast someone said they spotted in this area. So, you're looking for that thing that dropped out of the sky, huh? I think I saw it crash just beyond this highway, but I'm not sure how you'd reach it. Oh well, I'm sure you'll find a way. Good luck! Objects can only be seen by using special items. Let's see what we can find. This is 
locked down. He might be able to get in through the back entrance. Here, build this to get inside more quickly. We arrived at the base, but something seemed to be up with the doors. Oh, hi! I was out here searching for space... Spaceship! Scrap parts when the gates closed and left me stuck out here. If you can find me some bricks, I'll come up with a build that'll get us inside. <laughs> oh, you got him? That's swell! Here is your brand new build. Okay, quick, build the generator to power up the gate. <laughs> Awesome! You've unlocked Benny's generator. This can be used to power up objects. Unfortunately, we weren't the only ones who made it into the base. Turns out we had some uninvited guests to deal with. Thanks for the help, matey. Let's put a stop to the rest of those scurvy scallywags. Right. Now, if you'd be so kind, how's about building the thumper we need to destroy those mounds of dirt? Put a stop to him for now. Ah, but it seems Unikitty needs your aid up on the roof. You'd better go see to her. Batman was his usual modest self. But his victory was short-lived. Not quite the man of bats he thought he was. Just then, we were confronted by this mysterious space traveler known as General Mayhem. She demanded to see our greatest leaders. Mm-hmm. <laughs> 
She was here on official business representing Queen Watevra Wanabi, the ruler of the Sistar system, and not someone you want to mess with, especially considering how unpredictable she can be. The Queen wanted to gather the greatest leaders and dignitaries from across all the known galaxies. She wanted them to attend some kind of ceremony that she was organizing. What was she up to? What evil plan was this? Well, we did not want to find out. So now, forced to face off with our newly arrived adversary, we had no choice but to stand our ground. <laughs> Emmett felt ashamed that he wasn't able to save his friends. There was a harsh reality in his world that he had trouble accepting. After watching helplessly as they hurtled off into galaxies unknown, we both knew that we would make it our mission to get them back. It's good to see you made it here safe and sound. It seems a spaceship will be required to pursue our missing friends, but the parts for it are currently located in Cispocalypse Star, beyond the Bricksburg sign. I must also warn you, I've been informed that a large alien invader has been spotted wreaking havoc in the area. In any case, you will be careful, won't you? Finding the parts we needed to build a ship wasn't gonna be easy. But we couldn't let General Mayhem get away with our friends. Shh! Quiet! Hey, check it out! It's the giant alien invader I was looking for! Huh? You need to get to the ruins. Looks like you'll have to take on the alien to get past. So, uh, good luck with that.
Wow! You did it! You defeated the invader! I guess now you're free to head to Sispaka Lipstar. Oh man! What a hero! So, with that little problem taken care of, we decided to continue on our way back to the city. Hey! The route to Sispocalypse Star is just beyond this door. To open it, you'll need to fill the machine with masterpieces. to get a little out of hand. We'd have to cross the asteroids to reach the ship safely. Hi. You need a hand? I, uh, noticed your ship had crashed and thought those Blacktron space guys might have caused it. I gotta warn you, it's pretty dangerous out here. Who knows what alien creatures could be around the corner? Well, what's that? Ah! <laughs> Soft bellies. Slam their weak spots to take them out. Looks like the area is crystal clear now. Your ship is over there, but it's not looking too good. Looks like you might need some help from my camp. There's a friend of mine past those crystals that can get us into the main base. There was no way to get the ship up and running again without some kind of help. Luckily, there were some locals nearby that looked sort of friendly-ish. Oh no. Those Blacktron space guys have sabotaged the bridge. We need to find a way to get it working again. It's our only way in! Thanks for fixing up the bridge. There should be someone in the camp who can help you out. Did you just arrive here? The place is on lockdown due to the Blacktron. I could open the gate if that's what you really want, but it's at your own risk. Thank you. 
right? Yes, I'm THE Rex Dangervest you've heard about. Space adventurer slash raptor trainer slash archaeologist slash cowboy. Mind if I save your life? Those Blacktron bozos made a real mess at the space camp, but you sure showed them. Let's go find my raptors, and then I can get you the heck out of here. And that's how we met the so-called legend Rex Dangervest. I'll get to his backstory later. First, we had to help him save his raptor buddies. All right! Now I can get my equipment dropped in. I'm sure a master builder like you can put together a simple homing beacon. Here, take these plans. We'll need to build a homing beacon before we call in the drop. Sometimes you might be asked to place specific builds from your collection. Be sure to place them in the build area. Let's see if you can try them out. With my crew back, we should be good to get your ship working. Those danger fists of Rex's are pretty powerful. Try using them to destroy stronger types of bricks, like these. we'd done, the ship still wasn't going anywhere. We'd have to get it fixed up if we wanted to get out of here. You want to know how to get into our camp? Who do you think you are? Hmm. I'll tell you, but only if you'll fight me and my friends. through to the all-powerful crystal! Oh, wait. What's going on? At that moment, things took a turn for the way less safe. Making our way back to the ship suddenly seemed like a really great idea.
We arrived on a strange jungle world in the Sistar system. It seemed kind of nice, but we'd need to do some exploring to make sure. Yeah, so it turned out this place wasn't quite so nice after all. If we wanted to get anywhere, we'd need to make friends with the other natives. finally tracked down the leader of our new friends. But we just hoped we hadn't come at a bad time. <laughs> went through the gate to the haunted village. You can use this wand to help you open it. Go talk to the king and he'll let you know what to do. This 
is Unikitty's magical paint wand. You can use it to change the color of certain types of objects. Oh, and it's probably way more useful than I just made it sound. Things were working out pretty okay so far. Our new friends seemed happy, and those temples nearby looked like they might be worth investigating.
chứ còn không cắt đâu. Whew, that did it. With both temples active, surely nothing can stop us now.
Okay, so after defeating the giant crazy monster thing, there was nothing that could stop us now. Don't know why I forgot to mention that part before. So after an as good as can be expected sort of landing, we decided to look around and see if we could find any of our friends. With the path cleared, we continued on our way, little knowing the danger that lay ahead. Following some pretty sweet rescue work, we spotted Benny nearby. Hey, who are you? <gasps> the intruders! Guards, get them! Chargers, target their weak spots while avoiding their attacks. Talking transporter spaceship, the cake bricks it needs to take to the temple. It'll help us to get off this world and find out where Batman is. We'll need to repair the transporter before it can start moving again. My welder would make short work of things, but it's gonna need some replacement parts before I can use it. Why don't you have a look around and see if you can find me a new fuel canister and torch nozzle? you've got ought to be enough to fix my welder. Okay, hand them over and then we can finally repair that spaceship! Danny's welder has the ability to cut through and repair certain types of objects. Super useful. Never a good hardware store around when you need one, huh? With Benny's welding tool fixed, the team got to work on repairing the transporter's engine.
Things were looking good. With a little hard work, it seemed like we might finally be able to punch our ticket out of this weird place. You know, moving stuff around like this wasn't all that different from Emmett's old job. I guess transferable skills are never a bad thing, huh? Wow, who'd have thought cakes would be so good for bribing people? Actually, anyone who's ever had cake would definitely think that. That's what I call some solid construction work. All 
our hard work seemed to be paying off. It felt like we were getting closer to where we needed to be. This was one seriously huge operation. Hopefully, there wouldn't be any more delays to our mission.
With that little distraction out of the way, it seemed like the end was finally in sight. We just had to transport the remaining pieces to the Stairgate portal. making it to the space temple we just needed to find a way to get in whatever evil schemes this queen was planning we knew we had to stop them oh, 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 hey you look like that bad guy uh, is he a buddy of yours oh, oh i think i saw him somewhere just over these cranes oh, 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 let me unlock the controls for you you like that. You know, maybe the queen isn't as great as she seems. We gotta put a stop to this ceremony. Now we had our Cape Crusader back, it was just a matter of finding a way to cause a little chaos and escape. Batman's grapple hook can be used to soar across the sky and reach new, higher locations. Have you seen Batman? He's meant to be heading into the temple for the wedding ceremony. Man, there you are. Oh, I've been told to help you reach the control room. Now the lift's stuck? That's the last thing we need. Don't suppose you know anything about powering up advanced space lifts? to stop the ceremony, I'm afraid you're too late. It's already begun. But if you can power up that fan lift and promise not to hurt me, I'll send you to the Queen's location. The fan lift's powered up now. Let me know when you're ready to use it. Are you sure you're ready? General Mayhem will try and stop you, you know. In any case, step onto the fan lift to proceed.
I can't stop you. Just promise me you'll think about what you're doing before you disable that force field. General Mayhem sure had some advanced tech. Like, for example, using her tractor beam, we could lift super heavy objects with ease. So this is where it gets weird. All wrapped up, right? Defeated the villain? Saved the people? Wrong. Why don't you like us? We just wanted to play with you. The people were not happy. We soon realized that the queen wasn't evil after all. She just had a thing for Batman. I mean, don't get me wrong. That girl has some serious communication issues. But all she wanted was peace and harmony. And Batman. But she had absolutely no evil agenda. Turns out Rex was the bad guy. I know, right? All that machismo, please. Yeah. Rex was actually Emmett, but from an alternate universe. Like a version of Emmett that traveled down a different timeline. So in Rex's version, Emmett crashed into a giant asteroid and ended up stranded on the planet Undar of the Dryar system. That boy turned bitter. He was forgotten, lost, forced to watch others play without him, all that time festering away amongst the dirt. He spent weeks trying to get back on his feet, which, over time, he managed to do. In fact, he built a time machine and filled it with dinosaurs. Emmett changed his name to Rex and traveled back in time. His plan was to save his past self and turn Emmett into the kind of tough guy he wished he could have been. Well, lucky for you, I was around to save the day. I knew what I had to do. Yeah! Hmm. 
Rex's heart was just too bitter, too twisted. He just wouldn't let it go. Unfortunately for Rex, he kind of ceased to exist. Because Emmett stayed true to himself, the whole Rex thing could never have happened. Complicated, but something to do with a space-time continuum. So yeah, all good. The queen just wanted us to come hang out and party. And who can blame her? For we are all truly awesome. <laughs>